Hi, I'm Bodie Pendus, and today I'm going to show you another free tool for your workshop. So I'm here at my table saw, and part of the key is always trying to get your table saw's angle at a precise and consistent angle to make sure when you cut something at 30 degrees or 20 or 45 that it's always going to be the same. So let me show you what I have for us today. There are a number of apps that you can get for your phone that are free. I like free. This is Wixie. Wixie, you can go and buy a particular uh, angle gauge for 30 bucks. But why spend 30 when you can get it for free? There's another one that I have from KS Tools. And so KS Tool has this protractor app and as you tilt it, it'll give you the exact angle for your saw. The third one is an angle finder. And so let's look at each one of these and see what they do for us. Here I use my builder's square to set my blade at precisely 45 degrees because I knew the square had a 45 degree angle. I'll get my Wixie. We get it here and if it's less than 1%, let's see here, we'll set this to zero. All right, now we're at zero. Now let's tilt this. And that says 41.6, that's like 42 degrees. All right, well, I don't know whether we believe that or not. Let's try the second one. This is KS Tools, Protractor, set it zero. Okay, and that says 44 degrees. We can come in here and set it at the target of 45. That does the same thing, so it, it's kind of talking to us at the right, when it hits the right number, 44, we just, all right. Then we go to the third one. Calibrate this to zero. Then we're coming over here. And that says basically 43. So KS Tools is going to be the closest one to what that my builder square says. Alright, so this one here calibrates zero and that one says 22.9 we'll call that 23 percent 23 degrees all right so our ks tools now that's uh, zero this one says 29 to 30 that's about right oh all right then let's go to the Wixie. We set to zero. And out in 28.4. There you have it. So those are your choices. So the things I did in this test to get this as close to correct as possible, I took my case off my camera. Now, the issue with this, I do have rounded corners, so there's nothing there to make it precisely square and it has a rounded in both ways. I used my builder square because I knew I had a 45 degree angle to start and I knew that that one would be precise. So get you a, a angle gauge for free. I think it's a lot better than $30 or $25 that you might spend on one of these. The precise woodworking is to be consistent in all your measurements. So if you liked our free angle gauge for your table saw, be sure and give me a thumbs up. Click on a couple of these videos here. You might enjoy some of those as well. Come back and see me real soon.